TGI fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host, Zelot, and we are here today doing the Alpha 8 Experimental Series. Uh, so last episode, uh, you saw me restart yet again. But look, I'm not restarted this episode. I'm here, crash landed, with the Robson protocol activated. Um, I hope you enjoyed the <laughs> the sped up crappiness of the last video. Hopefully it was Sorry about that. I didn't feel like re crash landing again. I didn't feel like sticking this again. I, I, I'm starting to run out of time in my life to keep doing restarts. So, <laughs> uh, so I decided to just stick it and throw that video out the way it came out in, and fast forwarded in those areas. And, uh, you know, um, it is what it is. Uh, hopefully you got some entertainment out of it. It was still, um, sucked but you know it is what it is today we you can see we are alive let's um <clears throat> we haven't actually died yet either and we've got a bit of a pad up and running let's i'll spawn the drone and get up here and show so i've i've made the cement pad i came down to the water uh smashed some rocks made a cement pad and just just basically a, a little line of sight um, protection for myself right here from critters. Now, I haven't seen anything spawn except for a slime. So there was a slime that spawned and kind of slimed around here and then took off. But uh, yeah, we're not going to worry about the slime today. What we're going to try and do is get our... Um, Cover vessel spawned in, so I, let's here, let's get out of this. Let's go into our survival constructor. <clears throat> um, I've pretty much smelted, well, no, I haven't. Actually, I can still smelt a bit. I've got lots of wood. Uh, I don't have a lot of food. I've got some on me, and that's enough to keep me alive for now. But I think what we're going to do, we've got enough stuff that we can actually, and you can see we've got a bunch of biofuel because we have not got any, or not Pentaxa, but Promethium. And I never discovered any either. So that's okay, we've got biofuel, we've got lots of wood. We can actually run our uh, starting environment in with biofuel. There's lots of trees around. So let's spawn this in. I've got a hover vessel ready to go. This time I'm actually going to use my HV box top starter with my constructor. This is my updated one. Keep in mind folks this is just the interior shell of what it actually is going to become. Here let's spawn my drone. Just get this up here. Um, stop that. Let's get this down a bit. We'll just get it right to the, nope. Get it to the edge there. Up a lip. Come on, right there. <clears throat> okay. That way I can just stand here and keep using it. Um, and you can see it's got a mobile constructor. The mobile constructors now can do more stuff than they used to. And I'm not high enough level to do any of them. So <laughs> we're not going to do that. What we're going to do, though, is we're going to grab our stuff from here. I'm going to grab all this stuff. I don't need that. I'll take that. And yeah, we can leave the rest in here. Okay, so yeah, we don't need the spoiled food. Okay, let's jump up here. And now we don't actually have a jet pack because we don't have armor yet, but that's okay. We can super jump like Super Mario, whoa, and break our leg. Uh, you can actually break your leg jumping without a jet pack. So, yeah, there's always that to consider. <clears throat> Let's get into third person view here. We'll just jump in the control panel. <clears throat> there's a couple things I want to do really quick before I get this going. Is uh, I'm going to set up a custom group here called engines and place all of my engine like devices in 
well, I'm going to auto group everything first here. And then I'm going to put my hover engines in the engines group, uh, RCS in the engines group, and all my thruster groups in there. Now the reason I do this is so that I can just turn off all of my engines when I'm shut down <clears throat> and just have base the other stuff basics running like my constructor and fridge, which I, I don't actually have a fridge right now, but we'll have to rectify that. Um, now that we have that named, uh, let's go back into here and we can't power it up because we've got to go into here and manage. We're going to just... We've got lots of wood logs, so I think we'll just throw the whole kit and caboodle in here for now. Gave us 40%. <clears throat> That's not bad. That'll give it, give us enough to get going. So, and we can make another uh, double that gives us the amount. Double the amount of logs you have gives you the amount of biofuel you can make. So we can make another 36 biofuel with the amount of logs we have. So that's awesome. Uh, also. What we're going to do, let's fire this up, and we'll go into the, here, we'll just shut the engines off for now, because we don't need to waste the biofuel on, on that. Uh, what we're going to do is check out what we can do in the mobile constructor. So let's get all this stuff in here. Okay, and as you can see, we haven't unlocked squat, really. We've unlocked harvest box um, I got a small tool unlocked just just because next next time I level I can start unlocking more I'm only level three right so I haven't really been able to unlock much what I did unlock though was the harvest module which we're gonna build right now oh and I should have queued up the the harvest box too uh, what this is gonna allow us to do is go around and collect more wood and resources while being uh, out of sight inside of our uh, box top design hover vehicle. <clears throat> and the great thing is, is we still get XP for killing stuff with the harvest module. So we can get some levels out of this and collect meat uh, and resources. It's, it's like, it's basically gets you into the next stage of the game. Once you get a HV up with a harvest module, um, you pretty much don't have to worry about food at that point. Nearly as bad. It just Food isn't an is issue after that. Because uh, you can just kill stuff and take their meat and just put it, turn it into grilled steak. And it's, and it's awesome. <laughs> Okay, so now you can see that there's way more stuff in the mobile constructor that can be unlocked. Um, so pretty much everything that uh, you can make SV parts in there now, uh, which is great. So the HV thrusters, um, I'm not sure about SV thrusters though. Yep, SV, the medium block thrusters. You can't do some of the more advanced stuff and advanced weaponry, but what you'll notice is we can actually build the Gatling guns and the 15 mil bullets in the mobile constructor now. So that's huge. That's a huge step towards independence in a vehicle. And yeah, I mean, this is like, this This is slowly making it so that you can, you can live off a, on your vehicle. You can really now live off your vehicle because now you can make make and and equip and arm weapons on your vehicles, uh, which you could never do before with the mobile constructor. So that's really awesome. Uh, it also does some, some other stuff now too. It can make a pulse rifle. Uh, it can make laser pistols. So it can make a lot of the handheld weapons, the minigun. Um, it can make all the stuff it used to, too. It can do sniper rifles, rocket launchers, shotguns, uh, and all the ammo for those said weapons. So really huge, though. But the Gatling gun for the SVHV is huge. That Now the mobile constructor can make the ammo and the weapon for that. That's 
that's a loan. That's a big, big deal. Believe me, you might not think so, but that is a big deal in this game. Um, one of the more significant changes in 1610, in my opinion, on how people will play the game and use HVs and SVs, because I think people weren't using HVs nearly as much as they should have been in Alpha 7. And it got overlooked with the with the with the nugget mining and <clears throat> all that crap. So, oh, you know what I you know what I was gonna do. I think now that at the end of this episode, once I save, I'm gonna be going into the um, properties of the save and switching my constructors to be faster. Because now I'm out of the, I, I think I'm out of the um, phase where a constructor makes a difference in how fast it is for, for, for difficulty. Now all it does is just drag out the game. It doesn't make it any more difficult at this point. <clears throat> okay, so. Um, well, I guess we, you know what, let's equip this stuff, right? So. Get this stuff on here. Put this down here. And we'll just put the box over here. And we're going to go uh, see if we can find some Prometheum. And while we're doing that, we should actually get some... Uh, let's spin that so that's not facing that. <clears throat> there we go. Okay. So... Yeah, let's get out of here, get back into here, and oh, let's turn our engines on, derp a derp, and we're also going to go into our devices now, and we're going to start pumping out, uh, let's queue up uh, at least 10 biofuel for now. we got none on us, so we're going to need it for the drill. Okay. Let's get going, see what we can see. So, we need to find some critters right off the bat. And, yeah, see if we can get some meat. Now, there's what I can do, I guess, is there's a bunch of stuff right around here I could jump out and just grab really quick. And get that producing uh, some power bars in my suit. And I see some, I see some grain over there too. I think I'll grab that. And oh, can I not get out of here? Hmm. Maybe I didn't think about this too well. I thought I could jump out of here. Come on, jump up onto here. Am I trapped in my own HV? That'd be tragic. I'm funny. Um. Can I not get onto? Oh. Come on, come on. So I'm, oh, oh, and there we go. I knew I could get out. I, I, yeah. Because, <laughs> you know, you can jump high enough to break your leg. So, oh, really? Really? Oh, yeah. Freaking ghost protein. And, uh, ghost, really? It's all ghosted? Like, uh. <sighs> Maybe it hasn't. Maybe I picked it. Maybe I ran around. Did I run around and pick that stuff? Now I can't even remember. <clears throat> okay. Well, <laughs> let's find some meat. I didn't want vegetable burgers anyway. Uh, oh! Um, something's flying over the water over there. Why? Why is it flying over the water? Is it coming this way? Is it coming this way? Why is it over the water? A rocket drone. What's it doing? Really? Huh. I don't like that. Wow. 
Um, okay. So that's not a glitch, you know, it's just sitting there out in the middle of the lake doing nothing. Hmm. I wonder if we, can we break these rocks with our... Oh, 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 meat, meat, meat. I see meat. I mean, triceratops. <clears throat> well, let's lower this. And we'll just... It's nice that they just stand there and let me grind them up now. It's, um... <laughs> no, it's kind of... Stop it. Thank you. There we go. Okay, I want your stuff. Oh, two meat. That's okay. That's okay. Better than nothing. And we can actually... Um, actually, we'll just hold on to that for now. We'll just hold on to that. Oh, yeah, it's 66. Eat one of those. We're okay. Okay. Let's find some more meat. Because uh, that'll give us some more experience. And we should actually get s this stuff, too. And it's going to leave half... Or it's going to... It gives us double the amount, but only picks up half of... So it gives us the normal amount when we... But it's it's like... See, now when I... When I jump out... And take a look... See, there's still a nugget there. So what I've noticed is... I think... I don't think it's a bug. I think it's just not working fully how they wanted it. It's either... They either intended everything to be double the amount because even when you use your everything splits into two chunks it seems everything is splitting into two chunks uh the the and your tools are only picking up one of the chunks it seems um yeah <clears throat> okay uh, hmm. Family of these little noisy things. I think they need to die, but they're going to run away, right? So I need to, like... Yeah. Really be mean and cruel. Can I, can I kill any more? Oh, they turned around and ran the other way. They got smart. So now the AI for these things seems to be working pretty good although they only ran a short little distance so <laughs> lovely that the drone was working nicely now that is so special I love the drone I was I was a little sad when it wouldn't work there for a while. Okay. So, okay, what we really need to do is we, let's let's start heading along the coast here. What is this area? Is this a weird looking biome here? Let's head let's head this way. We'll see what's up. Now there's a bunch of resource rocks laying around, so I'm going to want to grab those. Or do I leave that chunk over there? It is a little annoying that it's only picking up one of the items. It's um, It kind of slows you down. And I... You know, I guess, I guess I could just not bother picking up that extra chunk, but it's like it's like double the amount of stuff you get. So I guess it's not really slowing you down because you're getting you're getting double the amount of stuff as before. So I guess it's all relative, right? Oh, right. I was gonna see if the big 
if the big rocks produce anything. Let's go take a look. Let's go see what happens. Because there's a whole bunch of these massive rocks now all over the place. Can I get out of my way? It's coming through. And it would have left a pile of logs. Yeah. That's so weird. Well, if I'm going to jump out and gather, I might as well do that to a few trees around here, right? I'm going to need the fuel anyway, because I don't have any Promethium, so let's grab that, and then we'll just jump out and drone it up. So, you know, I guess these things have uh, old school steam turbines in them, and we can just, you know, <laughs> use fire with water and create electricity. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. They're little tiny steam turbines, uh, guaranteed. With uh, They just look modern, is all. With little heat transfer units and yeah, yeah. Yeah, we're probably steam powered, technically. So, let's see how long it takes us here. It's a little on the loud side, but I'll just... Um, I'll just dial down my headphones a little bit. <laughs> well... If these things do give rock, it's curious to see how much it's going to give and if it's going to give anything other than just crushed stone now because I, because all the rocks seem to only give crushed stone. They don't give any of the other ores unless they're actual ore rocks. They don't give other ores, but you can turn the crushed stone into ores. And they made that cheaper now. And, uh, yeah, I figured that out last episode when I went to uh, figure out how to make a drill and realized that I had enough crushed stone for the silicone, and, and I made a drill. <laughs> okay, this is fallacious. I remember in doing this before and be like, okay, just, just about to give up and poof, it will pop. And give me a whole bunch of stuff. So we'll see. I don't know. Maybe they, maybe they don't give resources now. Maybe they're just trying to suck you into using all your biofuel on it. Maybe they want to kill you by using your, uh, your. Um, your survival tool on it and destamina. Oh, it worked. Whoa, 150 crushed stone and it left a blob. I, I wonder how much that is down there. Let's check out this little nugget. Nugget of 102. Holy crap. So that was 200, 252 crushed stone from that. Wow. Wow. 252 crushed stone. Huh. That's like 10 iron ore. Meh. <laughs> uh, when you do the math, it's not all that good. It's not all that good. It's not good. Okay. Um, um, hmm. That guy's making me nervous out in the water. I don't want to get too close to him. Watch him launch a missile at me. And I wonder if he's that like bomber, the new bomber or something, and he's glitched out. I don't know. I don't know. I just don't know. 
Okay, we've got three foo, three meat. It's going to spoil 13 minutes. 63, so 13. And we'll go to 13. Okay. Just seeing how much time we have. I really need. Oh, there's silicone too. There. I'm going to jump out and grab stuff. It might as well be multiple things, right? Right? Be as efficient as possible. Multitask? Uh, where'd it go now? Really? Oh, there it is. Okay. Uh, well, let's just keep going. We, we really need Promethium at this point and levels we need oh what is what's that over there that's a trippy looking oh is that the funky looking ah okay so it's this alien landscape now look at this different whoa 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 whoa, whoa! I cannot go in there <clears throat> Holy radiation and heat. <laughs> How cool is that? That is awesome. Okay. Well, I'm glad I never went racing in there and then realized halfway through how derpy I was and die. <clears throat> okay. Um, hmm. I wonder if there's any, like, alien monsters in there, too, then. I wonder if there's going to be, like, like, um, like the alien spawns in there. The alien critter spawns. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay. Fine. I'll stay away. I'll just attack these guys. Hey, come back with my meat! My meat's running away. God, I hate it when that happens. Okay. Okay, where is it? There it is. Um. Yeah, I need to. I need to get levels. So these guys are gonna give me XP. Where'd they go? Come on, where'd you go? Wow. Oh, there they are. Okay. So, can I get more than one? I don't know. Can I get more than one? Can I, can I get more than one? Come on. Can I do it? Can I do it? Are they... What's he doing? He's slowing down? Okay, I'm going to have to kill him. And then... Come on, run into my blades. Oh, did he turn around? Ah, uh, where's he going? Where's he going? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Hey. Okay, there. There he got. It. He died. He died. And crickets there. And that dude's so. Let's just get halfway in between them. And the. The drone should reach. Two eggs. Okay. Whatever. Rather have meat, but that's okay. The eggs are useless right now, but that's okay. Okay, what's our... Oh, good. We're almost fourth level. I think we can make a fridge if we hit fourth level, so that'll help a lot. That'll help a lot. So let's... Oh, we saw those crickets over here. Saw some crickets over here, yeah. Yeah, and more and more of those other things over there. Okay. So let's get these crickets. Now do they get pissed off at you? And, oh no, they run away. They run away. Oh, uh, they're hard to hard to get to. I, I I don't have very good RCS. Hard to 
hard to, I'm not sure how fast I'm going. Oh, we got, we got raptors there. I saw that. Come on, really? <laughs> there we go. 163, okay, he was a drag for just 163. <laughs> that wasn't very much. Um, although he had some bits. He had some useful bits. Okay, let's check out our constructor, how we're doing here. Good. Let's get that in there and we're at 12 minutes. Nine minutes. Um, 12 minutes. We can still let it rot for a bit there. Okay. Uh, let's kill some more things. These raptors look juicy. Don't they? Huh? They're like perfect for like the barbecue what come on there we go oh are they gonna oh here they go oh good they're gonna chase me that makes life easier yay level four. Oh, whoa what 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 oh sorry there you go he wanted a shave too okay so let's get these and we can research fridge and what else what else we're we gonna need right away we'll take a look at the, the um i think we're gonna be level five to make the gatling guns let's take a look so we'll just jump into our tech tree um, okay, so what do we got for weapons here? We, we know how to make the assault rifle and the multi-tool that's good for now. Um, so the ammo box we can make. We can make the... Oh, we can make the Gatling gun. So let's do that and the ammo box. That way we can put some guns on this thing. Uh... What else? What else? We can do shutter doors at fifth. Okay. Uh, RCS hover. Oh, let's we, let's do the O2 station because that gets us closer to the armor locker. Uh, oh, speaking of, can I can I make no? That's level five. Okay. Uh, survival constructor. I don't need make one of those right now that's level five also darn everything's level five if we, we can go like this because i'm going to need that and we can go like that and we've got two points left to carry over okay so we made or sorry we we learned how to make gun so yeah, we've got enough. We can make, uh, oh yeah, we can easily make a couple of those. Uh, we're gonna need an ammo box and then we can make a bunch of ammo for it. That's huge. So we'll make uh, 1,000, 2,000, 81. We've got, we've got the resources, let's, let's just do it. And I might have to cook that up really quick too afterward. Okay, so let's keep going around and killing stuff and collecting the meat and getting levels because I need level five. So, oh drat! Now it's getting. Let's let's head west. Let's um. Ooh, we've got night raptors. Let's let's kill these things. The raptors are are nice and easy to kill because they just chase you down and they give you good XP. So yeah, we'll go. We'll we'll look around for night raptors and kill those. Hopefully, we find some promethium. Oh, and that, that reminds me, let's take a look at our fuel here. 
take a look at our fuel. Um, yeah, let's let's throw at least that much in there. We're gonna need some for our drill if we find something. If we find something. Okay, so raptors, raptors. They were out on the savanna. So let's take a look. Where's there more savannas? We is it that sort of brownish color? Looks like up over here is a lot of savanna. So let's head north. We'll head north. Oh, that's the mountains. Oh, we'll see. Maybe. Maybe. We'll see. It's going to get awfully dark. I need to to um, kill stuff to <laughs> be able to make some lights. <sighs> yeah, because, you know, that's... That's how you learn things in the world, is by killing things. You, you learn how to make lights by killing things. Did you not know that? If you didn't know that yet, then you haven't been playing Empyrean long enough. Come on. That's a really trippy biome. We're going to have to go in there once we uh, seal this thing up. and Take a look. Take a look really hard to see sorry folks um, uh oh uh oh we're getting into temperature problems here let's uh, let's get back down into reality here Wow keep forgetting this thing is not sealed yet I gotta hit level five And how far away are we from level five? Quite a bit. Okay. Uh, well, let's head west. And I know I said we're gonna head north, but um, oops. <clears throat> we'll head west right now into the sun along the shore, so that we can actually see. And get some uh, meat ground up. Come on. Be nice to find some resources, nodes, that uh, would give me energy, aka Prometheum. I don't really feel like running my vehicle on frickin' logs. Like, really? Come on. It's a hassle. Okay, wow. So even though that this is on hard setting, it's just the creatures are so sparse because the world is so massive. So massive. So I'm thinking they need to add more creature spawn points. Um, literally, probably double. <laughs> I would just start with double and scale it back or forward depending on how that went. Because, yeah, I, I don't know. It just seems a little... It seems a little dead like there's just not very many creatures on it for for supposing to be nope oh, and I'm gonna kill myself again in the why do I keep doing that you guys are probably all Zila 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 watch your temperature yeah yeah okay I'm going to fly around the mountains, stay down in the lower areas, closer to the water, just in case it gets really hot. At least I can jump in the water to cool down. I can't jump in the water to heat up, though, so that's, that's not really a viable option if you're... Uh, oop, 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 oop. 
critters, critters, here we go. And we'll lower down. Okay. Okay. So come get a nice clean shave. There. Perfect. What? No tip? Jesus. At least that guy gave me a bit of a tip. And that guy laid an egg. Oof. Okay. Let's see where we're at here with the constructor. Uh, nine minutes. If we plunk that into there, it'll bump that up. Okay. Getting there, getting there. So we're, we got some gear we can install. Let's do that. So that's very cool. We're out in the wilds, and here I am equipping my vehicle as I learn how to build stuff. So there, and there, and how close are we? No, oh, we're not. Okay. That sucks. And then, um, <laughs> thought, yeah, we'll probably be raising the level pretty quick here. We can put the thing, no, 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 no. Okay, critters, oh, wow. Is that just a rock? Okay, I don't want to shoot it. Oh, it's iron, wow, okay. Um. Yeah, I know, I'm leaving a little nugget of iron. Is that stressing you guys out? Oh! <laughs> I guess I deserve that for being lippy. Oh, because my hover height sucked. Yeah, because I'm, cause I'm an idiot. You don't go uh, over rough terrain in a hover vehicle with your... Whoa, what? Whoa, <laughs> don't flip over on me. Come on, what's going on? Whoa, that was weird. I was trying to... Oh, okay. Okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. <sighs> and... Okay, so now we got guns. We've got ammo cooking in there. So let's... Let's... Get all this stuff in there. That and that. Um, hmm. Should I put another RCS on? I think I should. We've got left there 10 minutes. We're okay. Uh, 51 and 0. Ooh, let's just eat that. And 161. 51. Okay, we'll just eat that, and then we'll cook up that meat once the ammo is done. Okay, let's head north now. And there should be some more rafters around here, right? This is all savanna. I guess what we could potentially even see is, as like harsh desert biomes, and there'll be like golems in them and stuff. Um, I think the, I think a, oh, I'm cold here. Darn. It's not good. It's not good. Critters. Oh, it's getting really cold. Oh, this could be bad. No, 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 no. 
No, 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 no cold. Okay, I guess we gotta head east. Crap. Gotta get to a different biome with a different temperature. How's this one? This is 12, 13. Not quite as bad. 10. Oh, it's getting bad again because we're up in the mountains. Okay. So, I don't know why I keep doing that. <laughs> <coughs> okay, so we're still not 100% out of the woods because literally we're still freaking freezing. Okay, I guess I gotta head south then. Head south, just to get into some warmer. Okay, it's getting a little warmer. No, getting colder. Really? Do I have any hot drinks on me? I got a few. Got a few. Ugh, I don't really feel like pulling out. Oh, there we're good. There we're good. Okay. <clears throat> well, let's head to the, to the marker, I guess. Like we originally intended. And sadly, I can't see squat now. So that sucks. Uh, maybe we can get some moonlight going. Had some critters in the in the reflection of the moon. I can see a little bit with the with with the night time, but not much. I can't see any critters. Like wow, where is everything? That's some extreme temperature change from just a couple of kilometers. <laughs> Freaking ten degrees Celsius, that's a lot. Is that critters there? No. Huh. Okay, so... Do I just need to jump out and start picking a bunch of stuff then to try and level? Because that really sucks. <coughs> I guess. I guess. Okay, that's going to annoy me. So let's just turn that off. Uh, okay. <sighs> well, we have a light at least. <clears throat> now, I wonder if I should make, you know what? Can I make, um, I should probably make a gun, right? Um, here, let's cancel all that and look at getting the assault rifle and a bunch of uh, projectile rifle rounds built. Yeah. Yeah, I don't want to jump out of the cockpit without some sort of some sort of weapon in my hand that's better than the survival tool. And that's about to perish. I can't do much about that besides eat them. Oh, really? Indigestion? That was stupid. Why did I do that? I don't think I have anything to deal with that. Oh, no. That was dumb. That was dumb. Round trip. Uh, infected wound. Oh, no. Oh, no. Um, um, what can I make to get rid of indigestion? I got to pick the... I got to pick the... There, I'm not even close to those things. Crap! I don't want to use one of my kits oh do those eggs or something let's let's see do those things give you I'll just I'll chance this here come on come, am I not going to be able to get out come on really oh there we go so come on really Um, <laughs> how about, there we go, <clears throat> there we go, uh, let's 
use our flashlight because that's just way better. We can see critters from further off. I think just heard something. Is that my f my own feet echoing? Vegetables, vegetables. I need something that's going to cure me. Oh, that looks like uh, aloe down there. That might do it. That might do it. Let's see. Yeah, herbal leaves. Here we go. There we go. <clears throat> okay. Well, there's lots of stuff out in the plains here. That's kind of cool. Um, pick up more of these herbal leaves. I have a feeling I'm going to be eating eggs for a while. Okay, we should head back to the HV pretty quick here because I don't want to be caught out here without a weapon. And I don't want some roaming drone to kind of just do a flyby attack on my HV and leave me stranded too. <coughs> Let's pick a bunch of this stuff on the way. Huh. Well, kind of uneventful so far, isn't it, guys? Sorry. Um, yeah, I mean, that you know, th that's what it is. It's There's not a lot of creators. I, I mean, it is what it is. It is what it is. <clears throat> so I think when I custom make my own scenario for my multiplayer server, I will adjust some of that stuff. I might go with a smaller starter planet size too. Uh, I think a level three or a, a size level three planet would be more ideal to a starter planet size. <clears throat> Just because it's smaller and things won't be as spread out. Because um, currently the, the level, the size four and five planets for starter sizes seem a little... A little, of ex a little excessive because you're still running around a lot on foot and on um, with your with your uh, motorcycle and stuff and a large planet just sucks to do all that kind of stuff with. I guess we can grab some of this rock drill. Hmm. A stone. Okay, let's head back. Okay, so uh, where did we get to? Oh, we actually got a good chunk of experience just for running around doing that stuff. Okay, all right, that's good. And we've got some stuff we can make so let's do that let's do that so we'll move this stuff i'm not gonna need that there let's put that there um, so we can make grilled steak isn't that interesting grilled steak and i had a bunch of stuff go spoiled on me yay uh yeah grilled steak sounds awesome although it perish time of really low, but I'm going to eat most of it right away, so, meh. <clears throat> Health 60, perish time 22, okay. Okay, all right. Uh, let's fire this up, get heading, and you know what else we should do? We should get, um, let's just put 
couple of these in there for now while I remember so that we can go like this and go like this and oh uh, let's check our harvest module or not harvest module the uh, harvest box and get all that stuff and throw that stuff in here too <coughs> Too. Okay. Eat that. And okay. <coughs> uh, oh, that heats you up too. That's good. That's good. And so it's got lots of meat to cook up. So let's continue cooking that. Let's make sure it all cooks up then. And. Huh. That's interesting. Let's throw some of that up there. We can do... Um, I think it'll convert that to meat and cook it up as steak anyway. So that's cool. I like that. That is... That's neat. That's neat. I like that. Um, let's put that in here. There, now we got some... Okay. And then we... Oh. Uh... Let's, once that's done, we want this queued back up for like, I don't know, 20 of those, I guess. <coughs> okay. Okay, so let's... Get kind of in the middle of an area where there's a bunch of plants. Okay, and then we'll drop down, turn off the engines again, because we're wasting precious biofuel. <coughs> Let's load that. I don't see any critters. Let's just, can we, what? So that we'll, we'll just do a quick... Because the light, you get a better, you get better vision with the, um, with the drone. So I can see further in the distance at night. And, oh, see, there's a night raptor right there. See, I wouldn't have saw that. I couldn't see that. See that? I can't see that. I can't see it, but I saw it with the, with the drone, and that's why I used the drone. So let's turn this back on and we'll kill that raptor. Ooh, it's right here. Yep. Yep. Because that thing would have killed me. Like two, two bites and I would have been dead. No armor on. We're on hard mode. Okay, so we might get lucky and find some more night raptors around then. This is savannah, so they, so they, it looks like the savannah is where the raptors like to hang out. That's cool. I like that um, you can now really distinguish the biomes and, and pretty much know what type of critters are going to be in that area so you can kind of avoid certain biomes I guess if you don't like them okay now I can't can't see any more raptors okay so let's drop down <clears throat> my my goal today is to get get to level five and I'm struggling to do that so we need to pick plants Okay, I didn't hear anything scream at me. That's a good sign. That's a good sign. Let's, let's, uh, we can switch to our gun if we need to. Let's switch back to this. It gives us a much better sight range. Oh, there's a night raptor. See that? Now, I probably wouldn't be able to see him with, oh no, I can, sort of. Now, he's going to start coming after me, so. 
I think we need to go kill him. Oh, come on. Really? Whoa! <laughs> backwards. I super jumped backwards. Okay. Uh. Oh, it's on. Down to 10% power. Like the pro Promethium would be ideal right now. Like really. Okay, where the heck was he? Oh. Thanks for screaming in my ear right there. Uh, you were somewhere right there? Yeah, you're there. You're right there. Okay, let's lower down a bit and... Just kill him. Just kill him. And... Is that another one I saw? No. Okay. Eggs. Ugh. Okay. They give me indigestion. Those dinosaur eggs. Um. Got to be a little leery out here in the savanna, then, because night raptors you can't get away from. If they're chasing you down, you can't get away from them if you're on foot. You just you can't. Unless you jump in the water. <clears throat> you know, unless where you're going is really close by. <laughs> you don't have to run very far. I don't want to, I don't want to do too much stamina drain. Because I want to kind of save it for if I get chased down. Really freaking freaky doing this uh, at night without armor on. Let me tell you, is that uh, that looks like silicone? Is that silicone? Yeah. Yeah, I, I kind of got to do my stamina management out here in the wilds little burst runs really can't just hold it down and and spam run all the time making sure that there's nothing respawning coming after me Usually those raptors, though, let out a big screech when they first see you and start running at you. They get really vocal, so it's, it's usually a giveaway. If you're wandering around, all of a sudden you hear a screech and, you're, and you don't know where it's coming from, just, just run. Just don't stop and look. Just, just run. I'm getting a little far from my vehicle. It's making me uncomfortable. What the heck? Did those just respawn? Did they regrow or did I pick these? Because that's crazy. No, I, I don't think I picked them, obviously. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, don't break your leg. <laughs> God. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> okay, so how... Ooh getting low we're getting low oh why are these not done yet really these aren't done yet I 
much more does it need? Okay, we'll leave those in my bag then. Let this finish cooking. I think it's on its last one. Yeah, it's turning vegetables into meat. That's cool. That's cool. Um, come on, hurry up. I'm going to run out of fuel here. Let's Let's just dump this stuff in here then. Okay. Uh, okay, what are we at? What are we at? We're getting real close now. This episode is taking forever. That's that's the problem with hard mode. It's a real grind. It's not so much super difficult. It's just a real grind. Okay, is this all plants that I can pick? Without getting bullied? Looks like it. Okay. And turn the engines off. Jump out. Hey, it kept our... Oh, that's because it's the flashlight I had equipped. Right. Come on. You can do it. There you go. Okay, I don't see anything. Doesn't necessarily mean there isn't. It just means I don't see it. Again, I'm not running because I gotta conserve my stamina for when the raptor starts chasing me down. I gotta be able to make it back to my HV. If I had armor on, I might stand my ground against one. Uh, I'd run against two though. There we go. Oh shit! Like right now. Run! Run, Forrest, run! Oh! Turn on. And... <sighs> yeah. Scary. I line of sight at him and he stopped chasing me. <laughs> <laughs> Level five. Woo. That was close. Well, guys, <laughs> that was fun. Okay, let's um, make our fridge and our armor locker. That's exciting. And armor, right? 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 Where's the, where's the armor and armor? All right. And then, hmm. Do I do that or that? What do we need? We need no. We need the um, we need the grate on the top. That's eight, and we need lights. That's three. There we go. <clears throat> there we go. So we need the lights badly right now. Well, that's awesome. Uh, I still didn't find any promethium though, so that's not so awesome. But we can, uh, let's just stop all that. Oh, that is so painfully slow. Okay, you know what? I'm going to, I'm going to call it here where this guy is just screaming in my face. Go away. Okay. So, uh, yeah, I'm surviving. I am now level five. And I've killed some stuff. And I'm not dead yet. And I have not found Prometheum. <laughs>
but I've got guns on my ship and I didn't need a large constructor for it. So that's really awesome now. Uh, big improvement, I think. I, I really like that. It, we've been, I know the community has been asking for that for a while. Like mobile constructor should be able to make at least the basic Gatling guns and the ammo for those guns. <clears throat> okay, guys. Well, I'm going to leave it here. Um, so next episode is hopefully uh, will be me back at base with a whole bunch of Promethean because I'm going to spend some time off camera here and just fly around looking for Promethean. Now that I'm actually level 5, I can put my grade on, I can put the, the fridge on, I can keep grinding up fuel, uh, biofuel, so I won't run out of fuel, and then... Um, and I should be okay because now I, my food won't spoil because of the because of the fridge. And uh, temperature-wise, I should be okay because I'll have the uh, I'll have it all covered up and sealed. So next time, guys, we will hopefully um, have a whole bunch more resources to play with because that's what I'm going to do off camera. Is I'm just going to go mining like crazy and get a ton of resources. I'm going to get all that cooked up and I think spawn in our first base. Yep, spawn it in. It's not really a base. It's going to be a CV, but it's a base more than a CV to start with. So yeah, you'll see. I think you've already seen, if you've seen me, my previous uh, videos in the series, you've seen me spawn it in already and seen what it can do and what it can't do. And what it can't do is a lot. And what it, what it can do is not much. So <laughs> it's a starter. Okay, guys, until next time, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day. <laughs>